What is one thing you will never, ever do? Combine frog and dinosaur DNA to create a theme park. Download a car. Suck a dick for bus fare. Again. Run for office. Crack. Give birth. Swim over a trench. Purposely break a Lego set. Heroin. I was on morphine after an operation and hated it. I have negative desire to try heroin. Become the NBA's shortest professional basketball player. Edit. This blew up. Like my hopes and dreams. Also I'm 5-1. For those who asked below. Imagine that the audience is naked while giving a presentation. My brain power is trying to keep the words going. I don't have cells on the side for that kind of imagination. Lick a puby public toilet. Trust a Sicilian when death is on the line. Stick things down my dick hole. Meh. Not even once. Eat the box that my pizza came in. Drink and drive. Fight side by side with an elf. Have a man take a fat shit in my mouth. Treat any retail or service employees like garbage. After working retail I couldn't bring myself to do it. Cheat on any of my GFs. I had it happen to me in a bad way in a four-year relationship and I know the pain. So I vowed to never do that to anyone ever. Have biological children. Too many bad genes that I would rather spare someone else from inheriting. Have a period. When another driver is trying to do me a favor that I deem safe. I'll never accept it, do it. If I do it at all again. It has to appear overwhelmingly safe. Without giving them a wave and saying thanks. A. Generally. Safe example. Changing lanes was always a problem back when I was riding in big rigs. We sincerely appreciate the people in the lane we're merging into who see our turn signals on and flash their lights at us. This tells us. We see you. You have plenty of room. And we are not going to be the typical prick who demonstrates that they want to die RN by speeding up. We got you. Go ahead and get over if everything else looks good. If you do that for a trucker and they flash their lights back. That was their way of saying thanks. Bungee jump. A broken rubber brought me into this world and I'm sure as hell not gonna let one take me out. Sleep with Ops Mom. I'll never has sex. I'll never do anyone. I'll never lose my virginity because I don't lose. Kill someone if this whole coronavirus thing goes to shit. I'ma be the guy that dies first in the movie. The whimpering one in the corner. I will never guild myself. Become president. According to my 12th grade English teacher. Edit. This comment was dead when I went to sleep. And now it's my most popular comment ever. If my path to presidency follows the same trajectory. I will unexpectedly win the popular vote in 2020 by right in ballots. Mr. Haker will still be right though because I'll be about 7 years too young to legally become president. Thanks for your support anyway. Reddit. Kill dogs. Marry for money. A lot of people asking me why not. Because I get approached by rich douches who think I can be bought. I'm not marrying for anything other than love. Period. Kill myself. I wouldn't want to take that kind of pleasure away from someone else. Semicolon. Give a fuck. Smoke a cigarette. My grandpa smoked three packs a day starting when he was 12 years old until he was 50. He then quit and only smoked two packs a day. He lived for another decade or so before he unsurprisingly died from lung cancer. Seeing what he went through in the last few months was enough to convince me to never touch a cigarette. His lungs were so bad. When the doctors diagnosed him the doctor legitimately said. Smoke them if you got them. Because you might as well enjoy your last little bit of time. I wish he could have quit for real in time for it to make a difference. Intentionally hurt someone in a major way. I think making other people sad or angry makes me even more sad and angry at myself. Be mean to my mom. Edit. Thank you all for the cake day wishes. How the fuck did this already get gold? Be intimate with someone unless I have a genuine emotional connection. Cut off my penis with a rusty knife in the middle of a desert edit. Thanks for the award. Rape a walrus. Edit. Your mom said it was consensual. I will never. For any reason. Do anything. To anyone. For any reason. Ever. No matter what. No matter where. Or who. Or who I am with. Or where I am going. Or where I've been. Ever. For any reason whatsoever. Give you up. Let you down. Turn around or desert you. Beat the game. 
Never fuck with another lad's woman. If she cheats with you, she'll cheat on you. And vice versa TBF. That shit will come back to haunt you. Answer this question. Edit. Fuck. Sell my soul for someone else. Let my toilet paper supply dwindle. Fly to the Bermuda Triangle. Then meet Amelia Earhart. And finally when it's all said and done. Cut my penis off. Not falling for this one. I always end up doing the things I swear off like sex before marriage. Getting fat. And doing cocaine. Hold a tarantula. Cutting my head for a immortal vampire that stole his rival's body. How has this got so many rewards? Cheat on someone. Granted. I'm sure quite a load of people who ended up doing so said this to themselves. But beyond the moral grounds of it being wrong. The thought of doing so and going back to your so. Dropping the news. Watching their reaction. And realizing you've made someone that close to you completely lose trust in you sounds absolutely miserable. And I certainly wouldn't want to be on the other end of that situation either. Download TikTok. I will never eat an undercooked bat. I will never eat an undercooked bat. I will never eat an undercooked bat. Meth. Go on a cruise. I will never get in early enough to one of those threads that has awards raining down on all the comments. I'll never take being able to leave and wander freely from my house for granted ever again. That. Fly in a Concord. I will never ever put nair on my balls again. Expect the Spanish Inquisition. Rape. I'd rather kill them or myself. That would probably be easier. I can't bring myself to think about doing that to someone. Heroin. Be in a relationship where someone loves me back. Single quote. See myself in the mirror with my eyes closed. <laughs>